Hey Simmers, welcome to this video. So today, I'm going to do a 30 subscriber special. And we're going to make a 30 bedroom house. I already made it, the shot at least. Um, because it took me forever and I already started recording earlier. But then like, I had to scrap it. So I stopped recording and then just made the show. Um, but anyways, we're just going to like, you know, furnish the outside. Make it look better, I guess. These bone balance aren't the best though. Because in general... I didn't want, I needed them to have like a way to get into these rooms and it was just, I had to add a bump out. And anyways, it would be really weird if it was just square. This house also has a basement. Every floor has 10 bedrooms. Um, anyways, let's start. I'm thinking maybe I can move this back a little. Okay, so for this house, I'm thinking like... <coughs> Okay, so for this house, I'm thinking log cabin. Like, really big, out in the woods log cabin. Because that's, like, the best thing I can do in general. Um, I think I might use the same one I used for... It's not in this in this save, but the one I used for my log cabin. I'm not exactly sure which one I used for that. Um, okay, so I used this one. And I feel like it's really good. Um, maybe a little darker though. <clears throat> well, then it doesn't look like wood. How about black? Yeah, I feel like black isn't exactly black. Still, it still has a wood look. I probably should have. Well, then it isn't matching the trim. Okay, here, I'll stay with this white one. I might change it. Probably not though. I always, I, I always make the mistake of making the floor plan before I do like the outside stuff, cause it save time. But like, then I have to do this the whole time. Thankfully, I don't have to do the basement, cause that's a lot of different rooms. Okay, now to add some windows. Okay, I changed it to cabin in the woods. I also added a new door and some new stairs to kind of match. Now I'm gonna start with the windows. I want at least every bedroom to have one window and some maybe two, except the ones in the basement. Okay, so now for the roof. Um, let's see. I mean, in general, they look pretty complicated with the roofing. Um. Yeah, they, they do, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that complicated roofing. Um, I'll probably just do, like, you know, plain stuff. I don't know. Okay, um, I added a deck because it looked weird. Um, but I feel like that's pretty good for our first try. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm probably going to do the landscaping now, add some paint, drawing paint. Isn't this great? Doesn't it look so natural? The grass. Lavender bushes. Ditties. <clears throat> okay, I feel like it's pretty good landscaping. I don't want it too close to the house because I don't want it clipping. Um, but I still think it's pretty good for, um, for a log cabin. I got, like, some mountain stuff. Just pretend that pirate ship doesn't exist over there. Um, probably add the pathway and then I'm gonna start on the inside. Now I should probably finish the pool first. Yeah, there's a pool. I just have to make sure all like the doors are okay so we don't need to like fix them later. That door's fine. That door's fine. Um, let's see. Pool deck. Um, this is pretty long to be honest. <laughs> but I still want it to be that long. Let's see, maybe two pools. Okay, I think I'm done with the outside. I had a wishing well, hot tub, telescope, guarding scales, marbles, kitty pool, pool, um, mats, a bunch of floaties that aren't usable. I just wanted it to be like kind of stacked, like it's winter time. Attic stack, hopscotch, water balloons. That doesn't really count. <laughs> Fire pit, 
And then a little cooking area, the cover. And then I think that's it for the outside. Let's proceed to go on the inside. Okay. Pretty, um. Ooh. What is that for? That was from this. How did it clip? I can probably just put it in more, I guess. Oops. Okay, I think that fixed most of it. Well, it still looks like that. I think it's fine though. I don't think it's that noticeable. Oh, let's see. Log cabins. I'm thinking pretty old. Maybe this, maybe I can make this a little bigger. Okay, so this space is like the central space. At least one of the central spaces. Uh, I was thinking maybe dining room and kitchen down here. Upstairs, maybe living room. Uh, yeah, I think that's how I want to do it. I was thinking lots of wood, like pretty much built from scratch. There's not like anything that's not really made of wood. Or like, um, at least the walls. Okay, so for the dining room, I'm thinking very long dining table. One that I'll at least, well, there's no really long dining room table, which is kind of inconvenient. But... Um, we have some pretty long ones. This fits 20 people. So... <clears throat> okay, 20 people here, and then I could have like a kid's table. So, that's 30 people. Probably around like $5 in infants and 5 kids. Um... My idea for this mansion was like, you know, a bunch of friends all going on like a getaway together to like cabin in the mountains. Um, yeah. Okay, so I finished this one, this little corner. I had a bunch of bookcase doors because I want, I didn't want in this space to be a little too doorsy, you know, doors everywhere. So I just, you know, covered these doors up. I'm gonna need to figure out what to do for, for these, but, um, probably do that later so giant kitchen lots of fridges lots of stoves lots of pretty much everything um, yeah okay so I think I'm gonna do an island now probably in the middle I mean most definitely in the middle maybe a rounded one okay so I finished the island I think I'm gonna be done with the kitchen Maybe I can add one of these again. Okay, so I added a lot of clutter on this side. This side over here is perfect for cooking. The other side really isn't, but I still like it. Um, anyways, now that that's done, let's go downstairs. Okay, so down here is the living room. It's gonna have a lot of couches, a lot of chairs, pretty much a lot of everything. I really like this. It's a living room. Have some tiny lip ink paintings, but some base game ones. I feel like it gives it two different vibes. I like it. Um, maybe some plants. I think that's good. It's only one plant. There isn't many like standing plants that look unlike the packs they came from. I oh, should probably add one of those tables under the um. Oh, maybe a fireplace. Mm, no, that's not gonna fit. Maybe just a radiator. Yeah, I don't want this space up. Oh, that's next to a rug. I don't know if that's good or not. Um, okay, I feel like that's good. Let's move on to the movie theater. And then the kitchen over there. I have two kitchens because in general, you know, you're not going to want to go all the way upstairs to, like, get food. Oh, it's clumping. It's fine. I'll, I'll cover it up. Let's see if I can do something with platforms here. Okay, so I finished it. I don't exactly know if it works because I don't know how to how really platforms work. <laughs> But I made it kind of like leveled. Added some movie posters. They don't clip. At least this one doesn't. I don't see it in here, so. Yeah. Uh, now let's move on to the kitchen space back here. Now, for this one, I was thinking a more modern kitchen. Even though I wouldn't say, like, 
the most modern. That's why it has like the vintage thing. The back stove. Um, some old counters, some new counters, but still old. All right, I think it's done for the kitchen, the downstairs kitchen. Well, I had some half tiles with the fridges and the stoves though. I think everything's done for the basement. Oh, I, I, need, I probably need to finish the foyer. Okay, I think that's the foyer done. I left this open because in general, if you do want to move here, you know, you have probably your like keepsakes because I'm guessing you're doing this for like legacy challenges, stuff like that. So you probably have like a bunch of keepsakes. I don't know. Um, next room would be upstairs. Yeah, upstairs. Okay, so over here, I was thinking skill space. Like all the, well, <laughs> Most of the skills, I'm probably not gonna be able to fit a rocket ship in here, but like, you know, most of the skills. Also, um, I didn't tell you this, but there is, there's two. Well, hold on a second. I gotta think. Oh, there's hallways on this floor, so it won't be so doorsy. So, let's go to skills. There's a lot of them. A lot of them. I'm not going to be able to fit everything. You know, cooking, stuff like that. Probably downstairs. But probably most of them. Gardening is down. Well, gardening is outside. Yeah, gardening is outside. Not all the skills are inside this room. But a majority of the ones I have. With the packs I have. Chest table. We have logic skill. Make this a music corner. Or just comedy since I don't have. The pack that has. I forgot what it's called. The pack that has. Um, singing in it. This. And I guess a bar. Is that all the skills? I could probably add a computer just so. Um, I can get some of the more skills. Expensive one. Looks like it had a small kitchen. Cabin blinds. Okay, that kind of looks weird. Maybe I should reverse it. No, it doesn't fit. Okay, I think I'm done with it. It actually looks pretty cluttered. Well, not pretty cluttered, but pretty, um, you know. I don't know, uh, different, because it's all a bunch of different stuff. I do like the balcony. Okay, you guys, I'm going to end this video right here. I'll be posting on Friday a part two. If you're interested in seeing me do all 30 bedrooms, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and tell your friends. Bye.